Where is Morris Cohen? There you are, Morris. If you sit down there, please. We're going to have a word about computers. My worry about computers, friends, is this. Stand on either side of me, chaps, there. Okay, now. My worry about computers is that computers are the big thing this year. There's very little you can do with computers on a show like this, but all the kids are gone bananas about computers. Now, this gentleman here is Mark Feldman. And how old are you, Mark? Nine and a half. And where are you from, Mark? Rathfarnham. And you are an Oric quiz kid. Is that right? Uh, yeah. Yeah. And when did you start playing with computers? Well, when I was over in America. And when, when, what age were you then? Six. And you've been playing with computers ever since? Well, not computers themselves, computer games. Like. Ah, do you do mostly games then? Yes. Well, you must be pretty good if you're an Ari quiz kid. You mm. sort of won a competition, did you? Pretty smart. Yeah, kind yeah. of. Yeah. yeah. Now, have you, have, you, have you gone, have you progressed from games into uh, figures or accountancy or anything like that? Not really. No, but you're going to, aren't you? Yes. Have you got around to programming your own computer yet? Um, I haven't really got a computer, but I don't know how to program either. Mm. I'll be learning. I'll bet you will. You'll be learning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You haven't got a computer, but you don't know how to program anyway, so yeah. it's no great loss. <laughs> but you'll be getting on to it. Yeah. All right, then. This is, um, this is uh, Johnson McAvoy. Johnson uh -huh. McAvoy. Johnson being a, a Christian name. Uh, how old are you, Johnson? Um, Thirteen. Thirteen, not right. How long have you been playing with computers, then? Four and a half months. Yeah. What do you do with it, mostly? Um, programming, gra games, graphics. Mm. Um, graphics? Why yeah. do you do graphics? What? Well, I find them interesting. Yeah, just just uh, sort of um, symbols and and uh, designs and squares like. and squares and circles graphs. and all. Yeah. yeah. And uh, are you programming yet yourself? Um, to a certain extent, yeah. Yes. And and have you got a computer at home? I do, yeah. Mm. Nork. And 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 you reckon that is the coming thing, do you? Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Are are you learning in school as well? No. Um, no. We only learn learn in fifth and sixth year. Oh, I see. Um, we're third and second and third years oh. aren't allowed to use. But you can find your way around the keyboard anyway, can you? Yeah. Pretty well. All right, then. If you stand over there, boys, just for the moment, because I want to talk to Morris Cohen for a minute. I'll sit in the piano stool here for the moment. Morris Cohen is off Tomorrow's World. And, and, and our difficulty, Morris, is that, you know, I know nothing about computers. They've left me completely behind. Now, if I went to you uh, with the suggestion that I wanted to buy a computer for my kids or whatever, what would you start by saying to me? Well, you have to decide why you want to buy a computer, probably because the kids are nagging the hell out of you. That's, That's the right, first thing. But be besides that, I believe, as do many other people, that we're going through the greatest social, cultural and technological revolution that mankind has ever gone through. And quite simply, you don't want to be left behind. And buying a computer will stop you being left behind. When you do have a computer, what do you do, it do with it at home? And again, I believe that within five years, every single home in Ireland will probably have a home You're computer. Kidding. No. No, I'm not. I, I do firmly believe that. So what do you do with it at home? Well, you can use it for leisure, such as arcade-style games like Space Invaders or its modern equivalent, or thinking games such as chess, backgammon. You can use it for business applications such as word processing, financial modelling, home budgets, or you can use it for education. And uh, you can use it for educating yourself about computers or educating your kids about computers. This particular computer here, the Commodore 64, is in many Irish schools. In fact, there's approximately a thousand Commodore 64s in Irish schools at the moment. So it many, makes yeah. sense to, to buy that sort yeah, of and computer. And do you reckon, Morris, that in years to come, anybody who can't play with one of these things is going to be illiterate? Uh, I do, yes, I do. And uh, with this particular computer, we have a small program up here now yeah. which will show us how to use the keyboard because many people are afraid of the keyboard and there's really, really no need to. It's a very, very simple program. What I'm going to do is start the, the game and a letter or a number will come floating down and I quite simply have to find the key on the keyboard and just press that key. So it's a kind of a short lesson in typing. It's a short a lesson. A rudimentary A typing. short lesson okay, in typing. Okay, let's see it happen. Off I go. In on the screen. There, Quite then. simply, there's, there's an F coming, coming down. down. You have to you find it that. and shoot it. And a K and an L. You're finding the letter on the keyboard That's each time right. and getting to it before that hits the bottom That's line, right. okay? If I press the wrong one, yes. it tells yes. me. Let's see if we can get that. And the X and, and the, the e. e. Soon a word will come up and I have to try and type the whole word. Before the word hits the before bottom. Before the okay. word hits the bottom. You it's going to come up P. any moment. Okay, now. play. Just, here's the word coming down. What is the word? It the is, word is once. once. O N C E. <laughs> now, just get me another word coming down, please, and then don't get it right. Don't get it right, okay. What is that doing now? That is just giving me my score. I got okay, 20. Now we're on to round okay. two. Right. 
and here we go they're going to come faster oh, and I will yes. probably have yes numbers coming up as well yes L9 okay N the thing to remember if you do want to uh, buy a computer is to go along to a good computer dealer yeah. there are approximately 150 authorized computer dealers in Ireland and buy one of the best selling computers this is rudimentary around. typing just showing you around the keyboard and here's a word coming down now, I want you deliberately to fumble this deliberately word deliberately to it right. fumble gate and, and crashed <laughs> there you are all right there you are. Listen, folks, there's nothing I can tell you more about computers on the program because it's a huge, massive subject. But if you're interested, you go along and talk to your local computer dealer and he'll help you. All right. That's Morris it. Cohen of Tomorrow's World, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks very much for coming.